Squabble up, homie. I'ma say it again. Squabble up. I feel like I'm living in the correct timeline, you feel me? Like, this is Christmas earlier. First, Tyler dropped, then The Cure released the best album I listened to this year. Now Kendrick blessed us all with Gene X. Bro, I didn't even really have enough time to digest this whole thing. Kendrick woke up looking for the broccoli and I'm still on my breakfast. I, I couldn't catch up with all lyrics and references yet, but I definitely will. The more I listen to Gene X, the more it grows on me. And although my favorite songs so far are Luther and TV Off, probably, I cannot dismiss the importance of Squabble Up 2. That's why I'm drawing a scene from the music video, by the way. It feels devilish in its execution. And remember, folks, this is all on purpose. This man knows how to make hits. He's done it multiple times, just this last year, mainly with Not Like Us. Like, I, I don't think this song needs any introduction, really. And the whole Squabble Up music video, too, it feels like it's executed to be a generational mark, you know? There's a lot of references there. And this man, as an overall, is a generational beast. And I really feel blessed to be alive in this point in time. When this whole Kendrick vs Drake beef started, I remember people in my social circle commenting on it and it really felt nice for once to see people interested in hip hop, even if just for the beef. And, and just for context, rap ain't as popular here in Brazil, most people don't know any songs from North American rappers besides, you know, Eminem. So seeing my man Kendrick being well talked was a breath of fresh air really. But at the same time, it felt like all his potential was being dismissed here. You know, I, I wish people talked less about how he's better than Drake and talked more about Kendrick because of, you know, To Pimp a Butterfly and Mr. Morale for everything that man is and has been for the last years. But I ain't gonna lie, it's, it's fun to see the man redefine the state of art around. And bro, it keeps getting funnier, like, this whole beef should've been dropped from Drake's part a long time ago. There's this whole lawsuit thing going on now, I think, and I, it's just funny to me. I don't know. I can't take this whole thing seriously anymore. Now, I'm talking about the Drake beef briefly here. Uh, beef briefly? Beef briefly. But I know Gen X is way more than this. Way more than this. Gen X critically acclaimed already and universally loved, and it doesn't take long for you to understand why. Its rawness scared me a little at the beginning, to be honest. Like, as I was listening to it, I tried all the time not to compare it to Mr. Morale and the Big Steppers. I know the man is reinventing himself and his own music of time. And as I said before, however, the more I listen to it, the more it grows on me. There's lots of bangers and very important songs here, and I think there will be something for everybody's liking on it. Even if you're not into hip hop that much, you should definitely go give it a chance. That Luther song? Bro, she beautiful. That makes me feel like I'm about to float. Like I'm dancing warmly in the world's coziest shower, I want Luther to be played on my funeral. I'll probably raise from the coffin and start vibing. Truth is, I don't really even have much to say about this album besides my experience in listening to it over the last couple of days. Maybe I will, uh, you know, read more into the lyrics and get more references as Kendrick drops more music videos, he probably will. And if I do, I will come back with a better video, but for now I just want to say that uh, there is this kind of tenderness Kendrick can execute in his lyrics and it's a level of dedication to his craft that inspires me a lot. By the way, the man himself shouted out to me in Luther. Look at this, that was funny. In this world, concrete flowers grow and then Gen X comes and suddenly you feel them colors to every vibe and emotion again. And this is one of the most important roles of art in my opinion. So thank you Kendrick, thank you for baffling us once again. This is crucial, this is crucial. Now that you watch this whole video, consider helping the smaller artists out and like this video and subscribe to this channel. I talk about things I like and you and I might like the same things. Who knows? You gotta check them out. Thank you for sticking by and I will see you around next time. See ya.